Hello there everyone, I'm meteorologist Cassie Nall and happy 4th of July to you for our Friday, our Independence Day. If you have any outdoor plans, then maybe heading out to the beaches or out on that boat, it looks like for the most part, the weather will be cooperating with your plans. The best rain chances today will be from the Tampa Bay area northward or inland down here around the Sun Coast. That's not to say the coastal areas you won't see any rain today, just that the chances are below average, which bodes well for your plans and for the fireworks this evening around the Sun Coast. High temperatures should top out in the upper 80s to around the 90 degree mark with lower 90s expected a bit further inland. It won't be as oppressive this afternoon as it was a little bit earlier this week. And taking a look at the tropics, checking in on Hurricane Arthur, it did end up making landfall as a Category 2 storm with winds of 100 miles an hour last night along the outer banks of North Carolina. It's now beginning to accelerate out to the northeast and it will continue to have that track throughout the rest of the day today, gradually increasing in forward speed and gradually weakening, which will help to keep it off the coast, at least the strongest winds and the heaviest rain off the coast of the major cities of the Mid-Atlantic and Northeast. Nonetheless, they still could see some heavy rain today from Virginia all the way up to Maine. We do have flash flood watches in effect and you could have some travel delays or cancellations in these cities. Just call ahead if you're going to be heading up into those regions. For the rest of the country, though, for the most part by tonight, most folks across the lower 48 will be looking pretty good for their fireworks plans and for us here around the Sun Coast. As long as those showers and storms do end up staying inland, things should be looking all right for that 9 o'clock fireworks show along the Bayfront. And of course, we'll be showing it on SNN beginning with live coverage at 8.30. Fireworks begin at 9 and going into the rest of your holiday weekend. Should be a pretty typical summer pattern. Light winds on, sh on Saturday will allow the showers and storms to develop pretty much wherever. For Sunday, we'll develop more of a southeasterly wind flow, keeping the showers and storms near the coast for the back half of the day and into the evening hours. Tune in to SNN, your Suncoast News Network, on Verizon Fios Channel 26, or Comcast Channels 6 in Sarasota County or 11 in Charlotte County.